Hey everybody, welcome to the next video. As you can see here, we've completed a bunch more puzzles. Um, and I just wanted to show you the screen again, because we can now kind of see what we're looking at here. It looks like they're on some kind of uh, extremely poisonous ocean. Um, we've, it looks like they're on sur they're surfing, or windsurfing or something. There's a little bit of a ship or something back there, but we still don't really know what, uh, what we're trying to be found out here. So, let's continue. And now the one that I dread, spelunking. Al likes to go spelunking for clay, blah, cave critter. I hate that. Cave critters help him catch Sid Mouse. Spelunking, for those who don't know, means to explore caves. So this is a cave. Get a good look at it. Okay, so we have to get these two together so that they can do what they do so well. We only have one banana. And this one takes a lot of uh, a lot of work because you got to figure out which tunnel goes where and is that going to be useful. And I have a kind of an idea how to do it. I mean, I, I have done it many times before, but it's always one of those that just takes a while. Okay, so that'll put him there, and we need to find out where the other one goes. Okay, so that puts him up there. So if we have him coming across here, we don't know where that one leads, but we can find out. And him, let's have him go through this one and see where that goes. This one, folks, might take a few minutes. I may actually have to edit this one. Oops. Might have to edit this one so that it doesn't take too long. Because this could very well end up being like... If you guys remember, I had puzzles in the my uh, Incredible Machine Let's Play that took like 15 minutes by themselves. Okay, so he goes through there, and he doesn't. The mouse doesn't need anything to get him to go there. He goes through there, and we're not sure. Oh, that takes him to certain death, so we don't want him to do that. And it goes to death for him, is basically, because he'll catch this and get stuck. All right, so let's see. If he goes through here, he ends up here and comes here, which takes him here. We don't really want him to do that. However, this guy went through here, to here, to here. Hmm. What if we open this one? And see if they meet. Well, they do meet here. But then they go back through. And that's not very useful. So let's actually open this one. Let's try that, because then he'll slide on it, and maybe he'll slide right into Al, who will immediately catch him. That's my hope. And if that would work, that'd be really great, because then I'd know it wouldn't take too long for this video. Because we're already three minutes in. Hopefully he won't fall asleep. Ah, shoot. This may or may not work, but we'll try it. I hope this works. This is definitely one way to do it. I'm pretty sure I recall that this is definitely one way. Obviously there are multiple ways, but this one seems to be the easiest, at least I hope it is. Yeah, he just does not want to slip on that. Or we have to somehow make it so that Al doesn't, uh, make it so he can't see Al until, I don't know. It seems like this should work. Come on, slip on the peel. Ah. Well, that both takes him to a place that's not very useful. I can get him to meet here, but... Where would he slide to? Right here? I'm not sure where this leads. Let's see what happens if we do this. Just as an experiment. Maybe I can get him to slide on it. 
Oh, close. Come on, do it. Get it. No. Maybe I can get him to slide. I mean, they're not, they don't give you many parts, so it's going to be something like this. There we go. That's how you do it. Tear him up. There we go. Next. And hopefully none of the other puzzles will be that challenging. Combustible Kitty. Help Sid turn Al into a crispy critter. And by challenging, I mean that it won't take that long to figure out. But I am pretty good with these. Okay, so we want to burn the cat. Alright, well... See what we can do right here. Let's see what this does. Well, obviously that doesn't work. Oh, you know what? Gum. There, perfect. Huh. Probably not how exactly they wanted you to do that, but that works. Bombs away. Help Al catch Sid. Now, here we go. Well, there's a wall between them, and there doesn't appear to be any way to get them anywhere else, so let's see what we can do. Here's what I'm thinking. It's obvious that we need the soccer ball. There we go. And that turns the chow man motor, but what can we connect that to? And we got a fish here. And this did, let's see, this pulled up, so we do have a rope. There's a balloon here. Oh, I, I had this? Oh yeah, see what I was talking about? How you can only make it a certain length, even though the uh, when they do it, they're allowed to make it much, much longer. Well, let's try this. Oh, gotta make it turn. Hopefully this will work. There we go, that shot to take care of it. There we go, perfect. A lot of cat eats mice in this game, but that's kind of the point. Next. A day at the circus. The circus is in town. Help Sid get into the big big top and find him the cheese. Right there. Alright. I think what you start with is uh Perfect. Here's something interesting that you they haven't shown off yet. What the pencil does. Check this out. If he sees, if he finds the pencil and then sees uh, Al, he will uh, erase him, blow him up. And if Al gets the pencil and sees Sid, he'll run over and uh, erase his head. So it can be used as a way to get rid of one of the two. Minus one mouse. Smack Sid with the amble. Which won't actually kill him, but they didn't say it would, so. See, they make it so you can't really place a bomb or anything near enough. Actually, can you do that? No. Hmm. So we use this guy, and we need... Oh, here we go. We can shoot it. Do we have anything to attach a rope to? There's this, but you won't be able to do anything with that. So that might actually be a red herring. So I don't see anything we have. Can't really attach a rope to anything, so probably not. What else do we have? Boom. Well, that opens that up, but it doesn't really do anything. 
We could deliver a bomb. But why? Let's see, we've got... Oh, you know what? Maybe... Ah! Well then, that might actually work. That may very well solve the puzzle. Let's try that. We're at 10 minutes. Ooh, doing pretty good. I love that sneezing noise the uh, gun makes. Did that work? Good. Perfect. Mouse hunt. Al's gunning for mice with his high-powered catapult. Help him bonk Sid with a boulder. I don't know why I keep doing that. Okay. So Sid's going to end up over there, and we want to hit him with this. Do we have a chow man in here? We do. But what good is that? Hmm. We may actually... Maybe we want to deliver the peanut. We do have a cheese, so... Deliver the peanut to here. We should pull this off. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, right. We don't want to do that because he won't be in the correct position yet. Okay. So this makes sense. If it works. There we go. Doink! Donk! Special delivery. Al's in the mood for some mun mouse munchies. Help him scarf down Sid. Another s Al eats Sid puzzle. Well, as you can see, they won't do anything by themselves, and there's no there's no real way to get him to do that. So we're gonna have to play by their rules. Here, didn't I? Well, we could just do that. It still misses. I don't think that's supposed to happen. Because otherwise, how are you going to get this moving? Oh, I could place it up higher, maybe. No, it doesn't really help at all. How about that? Ah, there we go. Okay, so that slides over there, and we're going to need this. That will get the ball moving, which hopefully should hit the chicken. Drop an egg, and we'll push this thing, which will make that guy push Sid into Al. Well, let's see if it works. Very nice. Eat him. Get him! There we go. Yeah. That's pretty much it, folks. It's Most of the time, the puzzle is, you know, help Al catch Sid, or help Sid do something to Al, or do something to one of them, or both. The amazing Sid. Help Sid find his way through the maze to the Cheddar Cheese Supper. Yeah, another adventure puzzle. It's okay. They're fun. That's the path. Right there. And here we go. You don't want to waste a banana if you can help it. But they do but the gum do has their special purposes, so you may have to mix and match. Yeah, so you won't quite make it far enough if you do that. And then this part is like that. We do get a ladder, but we can't. You know what? I've never actually tried this. While I'm doing this, I'm gonna try that. 
just to see what happens. Oh, he may not run far enough. Hold on. There we go. I want to see what happens if I put a ladder there, if it'll climb all the way and skip some of the puzzle. Because I don't think I've ever tried it. Wow. Well, that makes the puzzle a lot easier. Done. <laughs> see what happens when you try new things? Sometimes it makes puzzles easier. Very nice. Okay. Congratulations, you have unlocked several more puzzles. Uh, I just unlocked several um, uh, medium puzzles that were locked. Sometimes I really impress myself. Are you guys impressed? Hungry Al. Al hasn't eaten in days. Help him get his paws on Sid. Not a lot happens. Okay. Let's see. Well, one thing we can do is make good use of this. So then pull the rope and turn this. Might have to turn that around. And let's see if it works this way. Doesn't do anything because it's not pulling on it. Okay. That's where these come in. Uh, not over there, though. Okay, so we do that, and then the interesting part here, he actually falls so that he can, uh... Wait, what was the goal? Oh, he wants to catch Sid. Oh, come on over here. Yeah, you tried to get him, but you couldn't do it. Yeah, now he's gonna get you. Gotcha. Now you're dead. Next puzzle. Minimalist. Al eats Sid. Yep. Okay. Uh, I think one of the easiest ways to do this is simply to do this. Why do they get out? They're not supposed to get out of sync. There we go. Done. Like they said, minimalist, you don't have to do too much. Yeah, really, really hard. <laughs> okay, now the this one is a little bit... These next sets are a little bit challenging. The Gamey Show. Question, who was the 18th president of the United States? Help Eunice spell out the answer. Let's see, 18th president would have been uh, Grant. Ulysses S. Grant. Because 16th president was Abraham Lincoln, and what's his name? I forget. Uh, Andrew Johnson was 17th. Yeah, I'm a nerd, so what? Now, you can push the buttons here, or you can actually pull the, uh, the this to make it open, but as you can see, they're not going to allow you to do that. So we have to find a way to hit the button. Did I put that there? I did. Uh, let's see. Okay, what happens? Okay, so one of them gets pulled automatically when nothing else happens. Does that bounce high enough for that? No? We're going to have to make use of that. This might actually work for this. Except not at all. Okay. Hmm. Well, we might be able to do this. Actually, you know what? Come on. Okay, that's two of them. Okay, that's that's that. Um, let's try this. Perfect. Done. And I was right. It was Grant. I didn't cheat. Missile Mouse. Show Sid what happens when Mouse meets Missile. I think we all know what happens, but we're going to show him anyway, just in case he doesn't know. Alright, that does that. But of course we have to do this. Not that. Boom. There we go. 
And off the screen for you. What are we at? Oh, we're just at 20 minutes. Um, I don't know. Let's go a few more. Why not? Hairball Hall of Fame. Al has some unusual abilities. Help him use his special skills to send Sid to Rodent Heaven. Yeah, here's one that I think are going to introduce something we haven't seen yet, which is what happens... I don't know if this is necessary or not, but what happens when Al meets a hairball? You can kind of guess, but... Oh, actually, no, we did see that. Eh, well, whatever. It was funny, so we'll get to see it again. So what we got to do is get them to a, p a place where they will meet. And that might actually be enough to do it right there. And this should do it. Here's what happens when it hits Sid. We hadn't seen that previously. Very nice. Oh, oh, okay, perfect. This is the start of the hardest puzzles, so we'll go ahead and end it there. It's a pretty good spot to, st uh, to stop. There are actually more, um, more medium puzzles, but they're double locked, so we actually can't do those ones until we complete all of the hard puzzles. Or really hard puzzles, whatever they call them. Anyway, we will see that in the future. So see you then, folks. Bye for now.